soaring high in the skies while protecting Singapore is the Republic of Singapore's Air Force 145 Squadron, which came out tops as the Singapore Armed Forces' best fighter squadron this year. Also known as the Hornets, the unit beat four other teams to clinch the title. It last won the award 12 years ago. Together, the 40-member team operate the F-16D BLK-52 Plus fighter jets. We find out what makes the 145 Squadron stand out from the rest. Trust, especially in a fighter squadron like 145, is extremely important because when the pilot comes out, he trusts you with his life, essentially, when you tell him that the plane is good to go. So I would say trust is a big, big value that we have in our squadron. Typically for air-to-ground mission, the pilot would be the, the shield yeah, and the weasel is the sword. So the pilot is responsible for the defensive roles and for the weasels through the targeting port that we have on the jet. Once the weapons is released, we are responsible for uh, blazing it throughout to make sure that uh, we achieve a precision strike on the target. Uh, between the pilots and the weasels, we interact with, uh, with each other very frequently every day. Uh, we fly together, we brief, we debrief together. Between the air crew and the ground crew, uh, we always try to talk to them and get to know them a little bit better, especially when we walk out to the jet. Uh, we step out a couple of minutes before, we talk to them, we get to know them on at least a first-name basis. Um, every month we meet up together um, for like a barbecue or just some, for some food and drinks, uh, wind down a little bit and get to know each other on a personal level. The open culture is also what drives the commitment. Whenever we see things that needs improvement, whenever we see things that could have been done better, we will openly share it, debate, and come out with the correct solution for it. And we do not keep secrets from each other. When we do sharing like that, this is how we drive the commitment up. And with good commitment comes good performance. While it may seem cool to be part of a fighter squadron unit, it also comes with a price. For example, all pilots and weapon systems officers have to withstand nine times their body weight while flying the F-16D fighter jets. However, it's a small sacrifice to pay according to these men. Be the people I work with, um, the pilots, the whistles, the Air Force engineers, the ground crew, everyone works together like a family. Uh, we all know our job and we do it very well. Um, so we are one big strong unit in our 145 squadron. So the people will be a large part of why I come to work every day. Um, and of course flying a fighter jet at high speeds, that's another part. The fact that I'm able to make a difference and help my nation, definitely, um, in whatever way I can. But in terms of my way, it's some, a cool job that we get to do, to deal with fighter airplanes. The annual SAF Best Unit Competition was introduced in 1969 to recognize Navy, Air Force and Army units that have done well in the areas of combat readiness, operational efficiency and administrative excellence. For more on the SAF Award winners this year, watch our other clips.